What are you not saying? The mining rigs are not the only sin I committed in... Meeting the Lady of the Forge really brought back some memories. I thought it was only in my homeland you'd see such things. Mermaids who forge weapons. Aye. I remember very fondly a late nymph called Nimue. Very talented with a sword. Mumia. I meant that literally. Shame on you. She made the best swords in all the Isles and had big dreams about what she'd do with them one day. I wonder what she came for. Brother, what you said before about the oracles of your lands being fooled by their own prophecies, I get the sense that was coming from personal experience, eh? Yes. Once, I sought the oracle for a means to break my bondage to Ares. One priestess had visions that showed her Olympus would be brought to ruin by the god of war. Therefore she helped me, intending to undermine Ares and protect her realm. She did not foresee that I would kill him and take his office, but... Enough of that for now. Brother, can you finish what you were saying about the Oracle of your homeland? She helped you against the God of War because she had visions that the God of War would bring down Olympus. Yes, and in defeating Ares, I became the God of War. But we will speak of this later.
A gallo horn. What is it? Where did it come from? It's a very loud horn, and I've not the faintest idea. Mamiya. No, truly. No one knows where the gallo horn originated. Odin just gained possession of it one day. Brother, can you finish what you were saying about the Oracle of your homeland? She helped you against the God of War because she had visions that the God of War would bring down Olympus. And in defeating Ares, I became the god of war. In the end, I proved her vision of doom correct. So the Oracle herself brought about the very future she hoped to avoid. I suppose we're in fine company at that. What exactly are we doing, Mimir? Fixing a mistake. <laughs> Just put the key into that lock, brother. There. If you could give that drum a good loud strike. by now, but we'll need to free it from its restraints. Bocker. I captured it many years ago. For Odin? Yes. I thought it an imaginative and eye-catching way to earn his favor. It worked? That it did. The dock's inaccessible. There must be another way up. This creature 
You enslaved it. Aye. The Allfather put you up to this? No. This was my brilliance at work. I'm surprised. Chaining up the innocent is a favored pastime of Odin's. The irony is not lost on me. Stick left. Right. We chained the fins too. If you could. <sighs> Countless winters wishing it wasn't. But we're going to free it. And then... And then it will still wish for death. <laughs> now for the other thing. There may be a way to reach it behind that collapsed debris. Fat was a good source of oil for Odin's lantern. Oil for lanterns. Whatever anger you're feeling, whatever loathing toward me, it's nothing to what I've said to myself. Kratos, 
I see something. Stick left. The fan. If you could, I know. Just the tail left now. The wretch nest. Focus up. Enemy to your left. Wretch Nest was hiding some device. Is your favorite of Gavassia's poems, brother? Why would I choose a favorite? Dock still inaccessible. Perhaps we could do something about that from up here. Perhaps that's how we reach this creature's tail. Let's return to the boat. spoke of this creature does that surprise you that an old man would be ashamed of the mistakes he's made no
I'd thought, I'd hoped the creature would be long expired by now. But apparently the Aesir couldn't even be bothered to mercy kill it once it was no longer useful. We could kill it. No. Not when we can save it. Good. We can reach the tail from this dock. You would still save this broken creature. I know what it is to be imprisoned like this. I can't just leave it. And if it is beyond saving? I don't understand. Let us continue. <laughs> Left. Tail must be chained as well. Sliding down that rope should take us where we need to go. I see something. There. 
You're free! What's going on? Maybe it needs a little encouragement. Can you get me closer to its eyes for a face-to-face, -face, Bubba? Yeah! Another incomplete rune slave. Move stick, die. Move stick. Now, the word. Mecking. <sighs> Success. The gate is lowering out there. You're punishing yourself, aren't you, Mimir? For exploiting the laborers. For the Lungbacher. Of course. Who else is going to? I'd consider Odin chaining you to a tree for hundreds of years a sort of penance. We'll agree to disagree. <clears throat> Isle seems abandoned. Suckling back to the topic of prophecies brought about by the efforts to avoid them, I think I can recall such a story as you mentioned, brother. A Greek tale for the stage. Hold on, and prepare for battle. Another Berserker Gravestone. Thank you. 